What up, what up, what up, everybody? Welcome back to Today's the Day with Zach Anderson. Let's get into it. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Today's the Day with Zach Anderson. What up, what up, what up? Um, Welcome to Today's the Day. All right, what's up, everybody? Um, Welcome to Today's the Day. Much love to everybody. Today's the day. What up, what up, what up? Welcome back to Today's the Day with Zach Anderson. I am here today with Mr. Renzo Blazer from Blazer Incorporated. Thank you so much for coming on. I know you're a busy guy. Thank you for having me. Um, Seriously, dude, I tried to look up like what you've done. I get a bio. I do a bio of accolades at the beginning, and I seriously could not see anything on you, dude. You're a ghost. Yeah, man. I mean, I try to keep it low key, but like I'm here to be an open book. So whatever you want to know, I'm here for it. Thank you so much. For anyone that doesn't know, uh, Renzo started and owns and still is the CEO of Blazer Incorporated, which just has done a ton for the community, a ton for the me personally, to families all over. Um, I just want to figure out what makes you you, man. Yeah, man. I mean, it's it's kind of like a... a culmination of everything it just like i am what i am because of everything that's happened to me in my life and yeah i'm excited to talk about it well thank you so much for coming on i like to take it way back to the beginning with every one of my guests uh growing up your a lot of siblings what was home life for you no it's just me just you just me you know and your dad mom what did they do uh lots of stuff i mean my dad is my dad's great, man. He he runs he runs tons of stuff, but you know I kind of grew up everywhere, bro. Like I was, so, I am and still I was and still am a nomad. So where are you? Where did you originally grow up? I, I wouldn't even say like I grew up. You know, I just kind of existed everywhere. I mean, nobody's ever hit on that so far, but I like it, and I can see your side. Yeah. Um, high school did you go to school here uh no i didn't go to school here i like like i like i i learned from like i mean education around me yeah education plays a huge part we've seen books just learning learning like not the normal school but always yeah. education is important in those one percenters yeah i mean like i don't even like really read but like so books do not play a big part. Well, like, I think they do for a lot of people, but, like, I can just, like, like inc- like get so much knowledge from, like, I like to go to, straight to the source. Like, I talk to the authors, the, 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 the freaking creators and, like, get it from them. Like, that's how I, I love that. to do that. I love that. Know? That is gold right there. Growing up, when did... Like, were you always that spirit of entrepreneur? You always want to do something, make something big or? Yeah, man. I mean, like as a kid, like I, like I was a stockbroker, bro. Like I ran the markets. Like I was literally at age five making millions and millions of dollars. And yeah, like I had like a big seed investment from my dad, but like it, like it isn't like, like I made my money, bro. Like I, from day one, I was like. Just hustler. always there. I'm a hustler because we see, we see that later on those those childhood things made you who you are, yeah. and so you were always like that. It was always going to be that. Yeah, I mean, I'd say that like not even my childhood, bro, but like everything made me who I am, and I just before am. childhood. Yeah, like from like like day one of the human race, like I take it back all the way to there. Then it like made me like the first of our kind it is live in me. Nobody has said that so far, but I see that. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. So um, outside of high school, you right away, you already had this money. You started Blazer Incorporated or where, what was that journey like for you? I mean, yeah, Blazer Inc. is like my passion project and like my baby. And from the start, she's been like everything. Like she does whatever I want it to be. And it just is a company slash entity slash. I'm sorry to cut you every- off. Just for anyone that doesn't know, that's just coming in, that's tuning in, that somehow doesn't know who you are. What what is Blazer Inc? It's like it's everything. Like it is. It's not one thing, and it's not another. It is 
it is. I just googled the website, and it's just a it, yeah, it's just a black screen. Yeah, man. Like I think that like really just like embodies us as a brand. culture. Culture is huge for you guys. It it like it it's all that matters. It's we are a culture of things coming together and providing an outlook on the world. Dang. I love that. Yeah, I right. love that. Yeah, man. I think I think we're we're hitting some some big some big topics for a lot of these a lot of these people that are listening to your podcast. Yeah, I know. I know people will love it. I love what you're saying. Um it's just so I mean, first year, how is that going straight into a corporation? Like I what? mean, we made like trillion dollars first year straight revenue. Like we had like literally made more money than every other company in the world. So it's it's been a crazy journey from from zero from zero to a trillion. Like I mean, we're 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 nailed down. Working at such a big place, there's a lot of employees. Uh, I have people that I know that work for you. There are. Um, people just everywhere everyone knows you guys how big of like of an importance is your employees and like is that play a lot into what you guys do no you know i love them and everything and they're great like couldn't do without them but like i could have done it without them so you know it's kind of like yeah you know I feel like they should be grateful to work for me. Dang. And I hope they are. It's a different different outlook than we've seen previously. Um, so advice going towards more catered to like what you did. You are the top person doing this. You're When people s- hear your name, like you are one of the legends to do this. Mm-hmm. Um, just advice for the next generation coming up that are inspired by you, that I've seen your stuff. Do you have advice for mm. this next generation coming in, what would you have to say? Mm-hmm. I love that question, Zach. Thank you. You're really good at this. You know, I'd have to say one of the most important things you can do starting out trying to become, you know, whatever you want to be is really find what drives you and take that and get rid of it and make it all about what is going to make you the biggest person to ever do it and and if you can do that then i think overall you could be like literally the next Jeffy B, which is my boy Jeff Bezos, if you don't if you're not familiar, but like you know, I think all that matters is like really getting deep into personal and and personal and and non-personal feelings and and making sure that you really nail down how you feel about your success and what it means to those around you because if you can do that then you know you'll you'll be you'll be the only one to do it. I think that's the most important thing, right bro, there. Bro, don't touch my shoes, bro. I'm so, sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, for anyone that didn't catch that last part, just to summarize it, just kind of run it back. You basically just said to nail it down, to succeed, to be successful, to find your most most success. And yeah, I yeah. think, I mean, in a nutshell, that's it. Like, if they were to get anything out of this, like, I love it. I love it. Thank you. Thank you for coming on. Yeah, bro. Thank you for taking time. Uh, Till next time. Much love. Yo, yo, yo. Wait, wait, wait. I got a gift. Yo. Oh. Yeah. Check it out. Check it out. Oh. He brought gifts. Yeah, bro. I brought gifts. He brought gifts. Yo, I'd like to donate $1 billion to this, man. I love what you're doing. (laughs) You don't know. Thank you so much, man. man. Today's the day. If you're audio only, hop on. Hop on video. One billion dollars and zero cents. And for dope shit. Thank you, man. Yeah, thank no problem, you. bro. Thank you, thank you. Well, like, yeah, I'll keep on doing it. But... Thank you. All right.
Well, you heard it here. Takeaway from Renzo, the man, the myth, the legend. Thank you for <laughs> coming on. Much love. Till next, next time. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Um, as always, it was a blast for me. I hope you got something out of this. If you got something out of this video of value, share this with a friend and please go show your love. We're on all streaming platforms, including YouTube, Spotify, and Apple. Any ratings, comments, likes, shares, they go a very long way and they make it so I can keep doing these things for you and I would appreciate it greatly. So please go share with a friend. Until next time.